Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you guys can probably tell from the title, it is going to be a holiday vlog and I just wanted to firstly come on and have a little chat. The holiday footage will be coming in a second. I'm not going to make this chat long. Um, but yeah, I feel like it was kind of needed, obviously, in the current climate and I just want to talk to you guys. I feel a little bit weird about everything. So we are going to Malta, which is currently on the UK's green list, hence why we're going. We were going to be going to Portugal, but obviously that got put onto the amber list, so that is that was obviously no longer happening. And we booked Malta on Thursday. I think the reason why I wanted to have this chat is because I know there's such mixed opinions about going on holiday right now, and the last thing I want to do is upset anyone. Like, that is not my intention whatsoever. So if you guys don't want to watch the holiday vlog, like, I honestly, I don't blame you. It's fine. Um, but yeah, I just don't want to upset anyone. We have obviously taken all the precautions that we need to. We literally have our fit to fly certificates right behind me. We're obviously going to be as careful as physically possible. Masks, sanitise whenever we can. But obviously we know the risks of going away and all the tests that need to be done. And we will be following every rule to a T. Like we're not going to be going on holiday and just forget that COVID exists because that's just not the reality right now. But uh, yeah, that is pretty much everything I just wanted to say. I really hope I haven't disappointed anyone. I'm currently packing, as you guys can tell from the mess behind me. Our flight's at 5pm today. So yeah, um, I'm going to get on packing and the next clip you'll see is us going on holiday. Guys, we made it one holiday. It's slightly echoing here because we are in the bathroom. Um, it's currently up to 10.30 here, I think. We're an hour ahead. Then we are in England. I've literally just got changed into this dress. It's from PLT. Just chucked on my Javianas because it is so hot here. This is such a bad room to be um, vlogging in. Um, but this is a little sneak peek of the bathroom. I'll show you guys the rest of the, um, the room in the morning because it's obviously pitch black here um however we're gonna go on a little mooch around see the hotel um maybe go to the rooftop bar for a drink um and yeah i'm just very happy to be on holiday aiden literally got straight into the room put on the football my sty guys on my lower lid did i say i even had one on my lower lid basically i had a sty on the top of my eye it's now gone down to the bottom um it's doable, I'll take it. If it means I can be on holiday, I'll take it. But um, yeah, we're gonna go have a little mooch. Oh, let me show the balcony actually really quick. So just for reference, we're staying at the DB, DB, I think that's like the chain, the San Antonio Hotel and Resort. No, hotel, spa, I'm not too sure, it's not along those lines. Um, it's, I think, I believe it's like one of the biggest hotels in Malta. So obviously you're not gonna be able to see much, but basically this here, is the sea there's actually down there it's like a little like inflatable adventure call so we'll look at that better in the morning um obviously you have the pool then there's like seating i don't know really this is a rooftop bar actually up here um so we're just gonna go have a walk up there i think we're gonna go downstairs though because we have to book our um like all of our meals basically in advance so we're gonna go downstairs and book everything just so it's all done. Right guys, we're in the lifts. Aiden's here. I'm here. How's it feel to be on holiday? Yeah. These lifts are very frustrating. Right, okay, I can hear people. We've got to go. Judging by how many people said about downstairs. We've got some cocktails. We found the adults only section, so it's where we're gonna be spending yeah. our time. Good morning guys. My eyes are very sensitive to the sun. Well, I said the sun. There's actually no sun. I'm not even showing you. Right now it's very overcast, but it's just bright. Bright white, I'm not gonna complete you guys. And we can have a little seat and a little chat. I'm not gonna go on this from a video, this would be great. Um, however, I actually don't know what the time is. It must be like nine something, maybe just coming up to nine. Um, and yeah, I'm all creamed up. I've got my bikini on, I've got my beach cover up. I think we're just gonna have a chill day today. We have a meeting with our rep at 10 past 10. Um, we're gonna go up to the adults on the infinity pool before then and um, yeah, that's what's really happening right now. Breakfast was great, I had some fruit, Aiden had like a full English kind of fish and uh, yeah, it's very nice and warm. To be fair, I feel like the sun's starting to come out, it's very cloudy over there but behind it it's just starting to brighten up. Obviously you guys couldn't really see yesterday but this is our view. So we have the hotel and then the pool, there's lots of people in the pool right now. 
um, and then obviously the C with the little like inflatable obstacle course that we might see if we can give that a go. Okay guys, I'm just gonna give you a quick little room tour whilst we're just popping in before lunch. So this is the bathroom, we have a toilet, sink, oh, I showed you guys this yesterday, bath, shower, the shower's actually really good. Massive mirror, I'm currently just, um, I mean, I know I meant to put warm comp compresses on styes, but um, it's really like swollen and ugh, having a mare really. However, we then have like a little kitchenette area, sink, fridge in there, there's also a microwave, some little shelves, I'm just keeping some stuff on, table and chairs. And then this is actually really useful. We have a proper good full length mirror, wardrobes, bed with Aiden on it. Right. Very nice. And then obviously TV. That's a door for an interconnecting room. Obviously you don't have access to that. And then you have the balcony. I think that we are about to go down for lunch. I'm just gonna put on a different dress because we're gonna go out and walk around the town. Okay guys, we're at lunch. They were doing sushi. So we've got some sushi, some, I've got loads of rice going on. Rice, salad, so Aiden's got salad and coleslaw, some fish and other bits and bobs. It looks great. Is that, what I think it is, is that I don't know, we'll try. So we're just walking around. We've been trying to find somewhere to change up pounds into euros we were really obviously unprepared last minute holiday and everywhere's closed because it's sunday so we're gonna have to go tomorrow what are we do we're not oh we're going to the beach but that's what we could do it in the morning golden bay yeah golden bay um we just got these are maltese ice creams they're the best you can get them in the uk you only get them from like little corner shops they do sell them in big packs but they're not this shape and like this shape is everything we also picked up aiden got a you should have asked her to open it for you um, oh, yeah. a blue lagoon and we also got a big bottle of water for the room but we're now just walking towards the beach to explore over there hello everyone now back in the room we've just been out at the beach and we bought oops you don't know how we do this yeah ow and um we bought some snorkeling masks oh there's a oh sorry that's that ball Oh, don't worry. Like the proper masks. I thought it was this. Oh, yeah. Um, we've just got some free posters. We have no idea what they are. Um, and we also got some shoesies. For some reason, the fear of something coming up and biting my feet does not sit well with me. So I bought some shoes. These are my shoes. Here we are. And then, where's Aiden's? I mean, they're not always comfortable with him, but I'm not gonna wear them for a long period of time. Aiden got some blue ones. We bought these masks that we've wanted for ages, but we just walked around to buy them. And then obviously they had them in the shop we were in, but they only had a small to medium, which will be fine for me, but just for Aiden, we're not sure. So, we'll have to see if it fits Aiden. This is going to sound so weird, but it smells like Chisel House Caves. It's a bit weird. Do I just... Oh my god. Oh. Everyone. I'm coming out. Right, mine fits me. We'll just have to see if Aiden fits him. Let's try and his on. How does it feel? I mean, you've got your hair in your eyes, but... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ada's thinking, please just stop recording. There you go. That doesn't look bad. It fits you perfectly. Is it like covering like your mat, like your chin? No. What? <laughs> okay, guys, we've had a, a slight glow up, to say the least. Um, OOTD. I'm actually going to Aiden in the back. So. Play suit is from a website called Showpo. Cute, wore this on my 20th birthday, it's been over a year. My shoes are from Primark. They were bought last year, so they probably don't have them, but Primark always have cute shoes, sandals for holidays. Um, but I bought them last year to go to Thailand, and we never went, but we're wearing them in Malta. And we're going to, called Salia. Yeah. restaurant yeah so basically there's this restaurant called Salia that we've got a reservation at this evening it's part of the hotel kind of 
I don't really know. We're gonna go, we're gonna eat so much food. But first, we're gonna go up to the rooftop bar again to have some drinks. And my hair was done with a Dyson Airwrap and I really took my time with it. I feel like if you want it to look good, you have to take your time and it pays off. But yeah, we're gonna go and have some food. I mean, everyone else is currently still at the pool. It's six o'clock and I'm like ready for my dinner, so. Our food has just got here. We, we've got a story time. Aiden just really put us in it, but we've got some catcher. Is that onion rings? Yeah. Chicken wings, spring rolls. Basically, this lovely lady came up to us, photographer, and was like, Hi, like, do you want photos? And um, I was thinking, Absolutely not. And he was like, Yeah, sure, go for it. And I was like, Sorry? So we literally had to get up, go, like, walk to the end of the section we're at. She was like, right, you're gonna stand there, put your hand on your hip, put your I hand thought, in your pocket. I thought if she was just gonna take the pictures right here. You're the same. Just like, and then it'd be like a... Who's a calamari? Oh yeah, calamari. And the onion, onion wings as well. Oh yeah. Um, um, so and it would be like, ah. Oh. And then she was like, okay, now face each other and like put your hands on his chest and his hands around your waist and like, look like we was getting married, but... We're gonna be on the website. <laughs> What do you think? My pizza's arrived. Aiden is he's digging all right, he's touching it all up. You help yeah, yourself, you side. go for it. That's my side. Oh yeah. So we got like some kind of barbecue to be honest. I don't think I'm gonna want the barbecue one. Well, we can just and then a veggie one. I don't think I've explained the concept of this restaurant. If anyone's confused why we're sharing so much. It's like a sharing restaurant. So we share the starter, a pizza, and then you get your own main and then you share desserts as well. A lot of food, we're eating good. Mm, good. Great pizza, also. The photographer has had another three couples up, so we weren't the only ones. It's okay. So, our main course has just come. Aiden got Samal. What is it? With Parmesan. Parmesan. And lemon. Oh, it's here, yeah. Um, and I got half rack of ribs, and then we shared the chips and the salad. So, you got some lemon there to put on your. Your salmon, mm -hmm. if you like it. <laughs> Aiden just went to grab it, but he remembers. He's becoming an Instagram boyfriend, guys. Well, YouTube boyfriend. Um, but we got some brownie, a little so square. It's not roof, not focusing. To be fair, at all. this is probably perfect for everything we just eating. Yeah, I'm so full, and a little apple crumble with some cream. I was expecting like. Oh no, I saw these when we walked in. I didn't realise they were there. Though. Yeah, right. Okay, we're gonna dig in. Dig give in. you an update on the food. And we're done. Now we stick the game on. Sure. We're now back from dinner and drinks, everyone. Dinner was great. I have a headache. A little bit embarrassed, actually. I don't feel tipsy. But I do have a headache. How about dinner? What's our, our verdict dinner on was dinner? Really good. It was good. It was a lot of food. We were just talking about it on our way up to the room. A whole bunch of food. And we were just in the pizza was unnecessary. A little bit much, you know. Just random. Yeah. But tomorrow we're going to Golden Bay. Woohoo! So we're going to Golden Bay and we're gonna go do some water sports. I'm gonna try and vlog as much as possible. Obviously I'm gonna be on the water though. In the sea. So I don't wanna get my phone wet, but I shall try. I'm excited enough for the evening. My hair looks like a bit dry for a hedge backwards, but that's okay. Good night. Mm -hmm. Wait. You want to say good night? Good night. <laughs> good morning, guys. It is now Monday morning, technically like, well, obviously we had a full day yesterday, but today is our like first day of actually going out to do things. I've just put on a bikini. We had a bit of a, a palaver, shall we say, with um, what I was going to wear today because what's he going down to the beach? I want to be comfortable. I want to feel comfortable in what I'm wearing. So we opted for this high-waisted one from, where's it from? Where is this from? ASOS, they do loads. It's like the crinkle material. We're gonna go have some breakfast and then we need to go change up some currency. I think a lot of today's fish will be on my phone though, so I do apologize. We have just, I say just got to the beach. We've been here for a little bit. I'd also like to do one of the paddle boats with a slide on. I need to look at that aid right? please let me. Um, and yeah, I don't really know what else we're gonna do. We're gonna try the, the banana boat thing. Yeah, if we can get onto it, 
a couch, a sofa one. I don't want to do banana bikes, because then I'll just slip off the back and I just won't be having a good time. Um, but yeah, currently at the beach. Yeah, we'll do some snorkeling with our new masks that we bought. I think for now, Aiden is just currently trying to turn his back. I'm honestly just staying in the shade because I'm so hot. Whatever we want. I kind of want to go get a drink as well at some point. Yeah. Sign off for now. I'm also gonna currently looking for some clothes from White Fox for a video I have coming up, and I'm about to read. Aiden bought me this book. When did you buy me this book? Ages ago now. It's called Talking with Psychopaths and Savages, Mass Murders and Spree Killers. Not the most lighthearted stuff, but I love a bit of true crime, so, well, in the most unsinister way possible. Good evening, everyone. We are obviously now back at the room. I'm currently filming a reel of like all of my evening outfits whilst on holiday. And they're all gone now. They was obviously here for the show. Um, but there was loads of people out on my balcony and they were, my daughter pictures me being paranoid, but I am sure people were laughing at me trying to um, get my real content. Right, let's put you guys down. So, I currently have on, we're having a bit of a mare. Firstly, fake tan, all come off. The sea, the salt water strips that. I thought it would be the chlorine yesterday, but no. Um, really did me over but anyway OOTD so shirt from Primark bralette that I've got under is from the choice of pink shorts Zara Are you okay? We're good we're good to go right okay let's be quick because the wind doesn't well the camera doesn't like this position and um, shoes Primark as well right we're gonna go can't believe my camera just fell hopefully we're still working if we aren't well, I guess there won't be any more holiday vlog. Guys, we've just seen these <laughs> fine old photos. Wow, love it. Look at us go. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is just not okay. I'm never posing like this ever again. Hello everyone, good morning. We're currently at Crystal Bay. Bit of a jump. Um, but we're just about to go snorkeling. It honestly looks incredible. Aiden is also here. All people going down the slide. Aiden is just like, can you hurry up? Because we just had to take some instas. He's like, hurry up, I want to go get in the water. You're going down the big slide. I see where the queue's like. Okay. I think the queue's quite big. We're going to go get our snorkels on. <laughs> Guys, we're at Blue Lagoon. We've got pina coladas and blooming pineapples. Aiden says it's it's a great peanut. I haven't really fully had it. I just got a bit of alcohol. But uh, yeah, just did my best life. Then I'm gonna grab some food and then go snorkeling again. Yeah, great day out. Recommend. Guys, I feel like in this vlog, all I'm showing you is food, but I've just got look at the size of this. Aiden's got a chicken and bacon wrap. It's great. I have chicken strips, chips, and salad. I'm sweating, but it's great. It's cost me like 14 50 which, if I'm honest, pretty decent price for the amount of food I got here. Good evening, everyone. It's now 8.30. Something like that. Something along those lines. We've had about 3 million outfit changes this evening. We're obviously now back at the hotel, back on the vlog camera. And uh, we're on our way for our last dinner because we're only here for five nights. So, um, yes, yeah, our last evening at the hotel. So, how do you feel? Sad. Sad to be going home? Mm hmm Yeah, we've got work, to not tomorrow. Mm -hmm. We've got to work on Friday, so... Then I start my new job on Monday, which is very scary. <laughs> evening, again. We're now out of dinner. How was your dinner? <laughs> Full. We are so full. However, we are currently on our way to go to some little shops. I feel like it's not a holiday unless you go into about 10 shops that sell the exact same things. Um, and we're going to get some bracelets. Aiden's like, please. I said to Aiden, I really want to get matching bracelets. So we're going to go and do that because I want to do that. God, I'm so full up. 
they had this like oh, yep that's a nice bird from Asian right on cue um they had lemon tart it wasn't a lemon tart more like a lemon meringue pie but it wasn't great and I was sad about it but whatever also guys around Malta you have to wear masks everywhere in England obviously you don't have to wear masks outside but in Malta you do I actually think when we get back to the hotel and start packing I'm I'll talk to you guys a little bit about like everything how everything's been in Malta and stuff and Covid shiz but anyway the boring stuff let's go grab some bracelets also top is from Zara Aiden keeps stopping oh. to burp um, I'm sure you blow it. nice but um, yeah, oh my god, my whole fit is from Zara. Well, Princess Polly is the belt and Primark by the shoes, but whatevs. So everyone, we are now back at the hotel room. I'm, I, I promise, like, I did curl my hair. What the hell has happened? I have no idea. Um, however, we've got our matching bracelets. Ada's just taken off his shoes. So I'll show you that in a second. However, we've bought a couple of other things. So Aiden got, I don't know why I can say it like that. So Aiden got a key ring, which is actually so cute it's, it's a little it's a little turtle you know we haven't seen any turtles can anyone see it is tray cute here's our matching bracelets mine's like a brown and a cream aiden's is a dark blue and blue we're cute and then we also bought i feel like people are going to be like to me today why don't you buy your mum a present my mum honestly doesn't want anything like whenever we go abroad she just wants me home safe and sound um but aiden's mum has fridge magnets so we get her a fridge magnet for everywhere that we go so we i chose this one it is a little starfish please do not focus why is it so backlit i want you guys to see this because it's actually cute it says malta palm tree little turtles again i freaking love turtles and it has sparkles on and linda loves a bit of bling so we bought her that so for us to get here we just had to take a pcr fit to fly test which they obviously checked at the airport and then they also checked when we landed um and in malta the main rule is obviously like social distance and to wear your face covering at all times pretty much like even when you're out in the street as i said earlier obviously back in england when you're out and about you don't like when i say out and about but when you're out in the streets you don't have to wear a face mask but here you do and to be honest most of it's mainly the tourists who walk around with it like off their faces but the locals like all like adhere to the rules it's been really nice coming though because all of we've been getting a lot of taxis obviously to go to like the beach and stuff and they've just been saying how like they've missed british tourism like we're their main what have i been saying sorry what have i been saying you haven't been saying anything oh, saying about the taxi drivers oh, okay. um yeah they've been saying that the british tourists are like their main people who come over so obviously not having us come in has really affected them so he said it's nice that obviously people are starting to come back over um so yeah so i feel like that's pretty much everything obviously to go home we need to have a covid test we do have to take a test on or before the like day two of being back so obviously we'll be doing that there's audio tests at home waiting for us and um yeah we've I mean, if I'm honest, I feel like we've been as careful as possible. I think the main issue of being in Malta is the other guests in the hotel. Obviously, I don't know how other countries are running their whole COVID situation. Um, but it's one of those things where it's as safe as you make it for yourself. Like, if someone's getting too close to you, move away. Wear your face covering at all times. Like, it, it's down to you at the end of the day. But yeah, that's pretty much everything I have to say. I'm going to pack. And I will probably catch up with you guys tomorrow morning when we are going home, which is very sad, but we've had a nice time away, which is obviously the most important thing. So everyone, it is our last few hours on our holiday. What's yeah. the, your favourite part? Mm. All the fishes. All the fish. What about your um, worst part of the holiday? Mm. You nearly get eaten by a fireworm. Yeah, oh my god, I didn't, we didn't even say. When we were snorkeling yesterday, there was this like wormy thing that we think could have been a fireworm and um, I nearly stood on him. But I'd say my favourite part was yesterday on the boat. 
Yeah, that was nice. The boat trip, but um. And the pineapples. Yeah, in the cocktail. Oh yeah, the pineapple cocktail. I was talking about the pineapple slices. Oh, we also got pineapple slices on the boat home. Um, they must have some kind of like deal with the pineapple people. The pineapple cocktail people. But anyway, we're gonna go. We're gonna go up to the bar and have our final few drinks. And uh, yeah, I hope Concluded. you all. Concluded. Conclusion drinks was the yeah. word you were looking for earlier. Yeah. When that, I was brushing my teeth. Yeah, that is it. Um, but I actually don't know if that was it. But anyway, I was I was gonna vlog us going home, but there's no point because. Oh no, when I was pooping. Thank you, because <laughs> it's quite boring. Um, so yeah, we shall see you back in England with a new video. Yeah, we should do that actually. We shall see you very soon, a new one. Bye. 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 Bye.